Hey guys, Grumpy Jamaican. How you guys doing? I'm doing all right. I wish I could say the same for these these folks in this plane right here. Now I saw this video on mainstream media this evening, and of course the liar from media stated that this incident took place um, this past weekend. But once you watch this video, the timestamp on the video shows that this incident took place on um, February, February the 1st of uh, this year. It is sad, you know, what, what took place here in um, Afghanistan. Now, this video shows a uh, cargo plane taking off at um, Bagram airfield in Afghanistan and um, the damn thing stalled out man and fell to the damn ground you know I don't know if the load shifted or if the engine the engines gave out or what but um, at the end of the day seven people lost their lives man RIP to those pilots the flight crew and whatever passengers they had on this plane now this video, I still find a few things odd about it, and um, but you know at, at, at the end of the day, people lost their lives. We don't need to turn it into a conspiracy theory video. The whole thing is just sad, but check it out. I'm gonna play it from the beginning here, so you guys can check it out. There's a plane right there. Now watch what happens. Look at that. That's real, guys. R.I.P. At least it was quick for all of them. No one had to suffer, but it's still sad. Now if you notice, though, friends and subs, in this video... The soldiers, soldier or soldiers in this Humvee are as quiet as a mouse. I just don't get it, man. You know, did, did the Matrix freaking military programmed out their emotions? I mean, no emotions, no nothing, no what the hell. Oh my God, did you guys just see that? Nothing. It is, it is as quiet as a mouse in that Humvee. Now let me continue playing this video. Nothing. It's, it's total silence. Even this guy right here is freaking out. He's running towards the Humvee, then the Humvee turns and goes around him. This guy right here is freaking out and pointing and running, running towards it. Then this guy in Humvee park as if to block traffic. So one minute and 15 seconds into this crash, this soldier just made that comment that you just heard. No emotions, guys. No emotions from these soldiers. None. None whatsoever. Absolutely no emotions at all. Um, must be a must be a military thing where they totally dehumanize and 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 um, break down these soldiers. I mean, totally brainwashing 100% that a human life is worth nothing, and that's it. Just listen to how quiet it is in that Humvee. Nine times out of ten, those Humvees are occupied by four. Or at least occupied by two. A 
I mean, damn, a 747 just crashed and nothing, no emotions. That's about the end of the video right there. But let me go ahead and back it up one more time, guys. So for any of you um, pilots out there, I um, don't know if you guys can explain to me what you think may have happened. It, it, you know, and and I'm just I'm just speculating here that um, either the load shifted whatever they were hauling, whether it was um, um, tanks or Humvees or cars or whatever they were hauling wasn't pro um, properly secured and um, the freaking plane just stalled man it looked like it stalled for a minute like it just stalled and then the pilots tried their best I mean when when the plane goes down you can see they had the landing gears out the pilots they tried their best man but um, they tried to recover but they just didn't have enough altitude and enough speed I mean look at that I mean look at that man Fuck. It's crazy. Anyways, guys, tell me what you think. RIP to the, the flight crew and the passengers. It's freaking sad, man. Damn. RIP. Talk to you guys later.